Child Turcotte Pew, CTP. The Child Turcotte Pew, CTP, score is a system for assessing the prognosis, including the required strength of treatment and necessity of liver transplant, and of chronic liver disease, primarily cirrhosis. It provides a forecast of the increasing severity of your liver disease and your expected survival rate. It's also referred to as the Child Pew classification, the Child Turcotte Pew, CTP, calculator, and the Child criteria. How's the Child Turcotte Pew, CTP, score determined? The Child Turcotte Pew, CTP, score is determined by scoring five clinical measures of liver disease. A score of 1, 2, or 3 is given to each measure, with 3 being the most severe. The five clinical measures are Ascites Fluid in peritoneal cavity Total bilirubin Yellow compound in bile from hemoglobin breakdown Serum albumin Blood protein produced in the liver Prothrombin time Prolongations or INR Time for blood to clot Hepatic encephalopathy brain disorder from liver disease. For example, when the ascites result is none, that measure would be scored with one point. When the ascites result is mild, diuretic responsive, that measure would be scored with two points. And when the ascites result is moderate, diuretic refractory, that measure would be scored with three points. Once scores are available in each of the five clinical measures, all scores are added and the result is the child pew score. What does the child Turcotte Pew CTP, score mean? Specifically, the interpretation of the clinical measures is as follows. Class A. 5 to 6 points to greater than least severe liver disease to greater than 1 to 5 year survival rate, 95%. Meanwhile, Class B. 7 to 9 points to greater than moderately severe liver disease to greater than 1 to 5 year survival rate, 75%. Also, Class C. 10 to 15 points to greater than most severe liver disease to greater than 1 to 5 year survival rate, 50%. MELT score, Child Turcotte Pew Companion for Longevity Assessment of Cirrhosis. The model for end-stage liver disease, or MELD score, is used to prioritize adult patients for liver transplants. Moreover, it's a severity index that indicates mortality risk and case urgency. Also, it determines how soon a person will need a liver transplant. You must have a MELD score to be put on the United Network for Organ Sharing UNO's, transplant list. The MELD score is calculated with a mathematical formula using three lab results. Total bilirubin. International normalized ratio INR. Creatinine. Meanwhile, the four MELD levels are greater than or equal to 25, gravely ill. 24 to 19. 18 to 11. Less than or equal to 10, less ill. Patients with end-stage liver disease are tested on a continuing basis. Greater than or equal to 25. Lab reports every 7 days. 24 to 19. Lab reports every 30 days. 18 to 11. Lab reports every 90 days. 10 or fewer, less ill, lab reports every year. When the MELD score increases, the patient moves up the transplant list. The PELD score. The PELD score, pediatric end-stage liver disease, is a version of the MELD score for children under the age of 12. Like the MELD score, it's used to prioritize patients for liver transplant. Advice. Part of the diagnosis and treatment portion of liver disease is a child Pew score for the prognosis of liver failure. Moreover, it serves as a marker for liver function and helps determine appropriate treatment. In end-stage liver disease, liver functions decline to a point where the only option becomes liver transplantation. So, to get on the UNO's transplantation list, you need a MELD score or PELD score if you're under age 12. Thank you. I hope you are always happy and healthy. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to receive useful information.